Calais, last time you guys played the Titans, you were not in the lineup. Brandon Williams was not in the lineup. And when you guys are facing a really generational running back like Derrick Henry, you really want all your tools available. Now that you guys are all going to be on the field, how different is this defensive line heading into this game? Well, you know, uh, you want to be full strength, you know, at this time of year, being in the playoffs. You know, you want to play your best ball this time of year, being in the playoffs. And so, uh, you know, uh, to me, you know, whoever we're playing, doesn't matter who it is, you know, we want to be at our very best when we're going to A game because that's the only way to guarantee ourselves a win. And I mean, any guarantee is still a big word. That's the only way to put ourselves in the best position to win. And so that's where, you know, we as a, as a, as a team, like we just want to be, you know, all hands on deck, everybody – all in, you know, and give everything you have to, to win each game. You know, win this first game, have a chance to win the next one and uh, go to where our goals are. Uh, you know, and so go to Derrick Henry, who is an incredible talent, you know, and this is not him. The team, the way they call the plays, office coordinator, uh, Tannehill, uh, you know, with the receiving core they have and, and, and the tight ends, you know, I mean, they have a, a complete uh, offense that goes out and does, you know, they play well together. They, uh, they're, they're, uh, unselfish. I mean, they're just, they're, they're a really good team. Uh, and so we have to go out there and, and, and commit to the run, but also be ready for all the stuff they do off the run. Cause they know, you know, people like to overcommit to stop with Derrick Henry and then, you know, they take the shots and, and do what they do. So uh, we just gotta be disciplined, you know, trust our keys and play good football. You mentioned committed to the run. Looking back to last off season, you were brought here um, specifically uh, to help stop the run how much do you think this game coming up against the titans was just what you were brought here to do to help stop henry and the run i mean i personally feel like uh you know uh you know the goal was to win a super bowl overall and to win a super bowl you have to beat teams who run the ball very well like the tennessee titans and uh you know some of the other teams are in the playoffs you know and so i do Feel like, uh, you know, when I, when I talked to Coach at the beginning of the year when they traded for me, you know, he told me, he's like, man, I, I love the way you play the zone uh, run game. And uh, I feel like the way you play that is going to help us win a lot of tough ball games, you know, late in the season when it matters. And so here we are, you know, late in the season when it matters. And, uh, you know, I mean, I'm just going to go out there and play the game the way I know how to. I leave it all on the field and, uh, and see what happens, you know. I, I'm, you know, I, I love good matchups. I feel like, uh, you know, a worthy opponent brings the best out of you. And so, uh, you know, I can't wait to get on the field and, and, and see, see what's out there. As a team overall, you guys head into the postseason, I mean, rolling. Winners of five straight after the COVID outbreak. What changed? Well, I mean, we needed to win to get in. <laughs> you know, it was pretty much playoff football uh, for five weeks straight. Um, but now, all that doesn't matter anymore. I mean, the records are 0-0. Zero, zero. doesn't matter what you did to get here. You know, now that you're here, it's a, it's a fresh start, uh, but I think really, uh, you know, what, what got us rolling, we got, got ourselves to, to get here was just uh, executing and playing a, a good team sound ball one play at a time and earning the right. Uh, you know, that's something that I always say, earn the right, earn the right to be in the playoffs, earn the right to be a champion, earn the right uh, to win this ball game. And that's stuff that, you know, it's an effort. You know, I mean, we have the talent, sure. Uh, you know, without a doubt, we have the talent to win, but it comes down to execution and paying uh, – you know, paying our dues to win that ball game. So uh, this is a this is an opportunity of of a lifetime. You know, I mean, uh, there's no guarantees for future years. You know, uh, my experience has told me that. You know, I've had a lot of you know very good uh, you know playoff runs, and then I, you know we never never finished, never got you know never got the host of Lombardi Trophy. And so for me, you know, I just want to make sure the guys understand. That, you know, just because you have a good team right now, we got a chance right now. You know, we have to get it done because. We don't know what tomorrow holds. All we have is right now. Take me onto the field to practice, into the locker room uh, this week. Um, as we approach the playoffs and the first playoff game, how has the focus, intensity, atmosphere changed this week around the facility and on the field? <laughs> uh, I mean, it really hasn't changed that much. You know, like I said, we've been playing you know, playoff football for the past five weeks. And, uh, you know, there is a sense of, uh, a sense of urgency around the, in the building. You know, guys are locked in and focused. And so I tell the guys all the time, you know, do what got you here. You know, we don't have to do anything more. Just do what we got, we got, what got us here. 
prepare to win a football game. It's a football game nonetheless. Now, each play matters more because, you know, if you, know, if you don't get the job done, you go home. But at the same time, no, it's just football game. It's prepare to win a football game. And then, you know, you're, you're one of the leaders on this team, um, one of the, the veteran players. Um, you have talked to the team right before kickoff, before we've seen it on the field. What do you tell your teammates on Sunday afternoon as you break that huddle before uh, you go in the locker room pregame, before kickoff? What do you tell your guys uh, before the Titans game? Empty the tank. Empty your tank. Don't, don't, don't try to save anything for any – just empty your tank. Whatever you have, I need it all. Give me everything you got. Leave it all on the football field, and let's find a way to win this ball game. Then we'll reconvene afterwards and reevaluate the rest of the situation. But just find a way to win this ball game and don't leave nothing in the tank. Calais, good luck on Sunday, man. Appreciate it.